before you do this there are shells and in this show I'll be showing you how to make a MoGraph text and here you see what it looks like now let's see a little preview of it and let's see what it looks like once rendered so first of all I'm gonna go file new go to MoGraph text object change the text I tutorials okay now let's change the font I have a good font that I'm gonna use you you unofficial BOP font you can download it from uh, the font.com and you can also install it you have to install the fonts if you didn't know okay so that it works but I might have the link in the description for this font okay uh, let's change the depth to 70 and okay let's have go to caps fillet cap and another fillet cap so now it looks much better with a fillet cap and now select text object click C and click on these uh, plus buttons here and now select, uh, select R or whatever first letter you have and hold shift and select the last letter and drag it out of the group and now select text object and delete it okay um, bear with me I'm sick today and that's why I'm not in school and I'm actually making this tutorial because I'm s because I'm not in school today so okay now um, now go to MoGraph fracture object now click on R hold shift select S drag this into the fracture object now go to mon graph again go to uh, random effector and select vector object then hold shift and select all these now drag vector object into random effector oh wait for some reason it's not working okay just give me a moment Okay, problem solved. Now, before you before you go to um, random vector, first select vector object, hold shift, then go down to the left letter and select it, and make sure there's all that it's all selected. Now go to MoGraph, random vector. There we go.